Why am I doing this business class, this Learn Live for small businesses? Because small business owners have Google Workspace, but they don't know what to do with it. They're like, oh, well, at least I got my Gmail address or my Google Workspace address associated with my domain, and now I'm good. But they don't know that it has Drive and Calendar and Doc Sheet slides. You don't necessarily need Microsoft. You can do it all in Google. There's so many other tools. So I do have a slide, and actually one of my videos talks about all the different tools that are in Google Workspace that you can use for business and how to sort of stack them and work it together. So please remember that Google, the company, works in Google Workspace. They built it and they use it for their company. So they have built in all the tools that a company needs to function or 90% of them. So that's why. I want to show people in this class coming up starting July 22nd that the first two days, we're going to take our time to get organized in Gmail, Calendar, Drive, Chrome Profiles, and we'll do a little review of Docs and Sheets so that you're comfortable with those basic things. Day three, we're going to talk about scheduling that includes calendar events and what you can include with those. So it's kind of like one little package that you're delivering and also appointment scheduling. Google has recently upped their game with the calendaring system and you do not necessarily need a Calendly or other scheduling system because you can have a booking page now sent out and people can book calls with you using a scheduling system. So that's day three. Day four will be dedicated to email marketing. So contact lists, Gmail templates, which many people don't know exist, Gmail newsletter layouts, which is in the business standard level, not starter, standard, and then using the mail merge feature to really actually send out your email newsletter or any mail merge email you need to send out. And with the required unsubscribe button that is required as of February. And then day five will be all about client workflow. So when somebody fills out your contact form, that information goes into a sheet. And then what can we do with it to make your client work with that person easier? We can dump it into a doc. So I'm going to show you how to do that. And then lastly, if you want more time either to ask me questions or to work on setting up these things with me at your side, day six optional will be a workshop where we can just work on these things together. That is my Learn Live class coming up on July 22nd through 26th. I'm really excited to show business owners what can be done. And this is sort of the explaining all of it and how it can be done. I don't want it to be too overwhelming, but I want you to know how they all work together so that you can pick and choose what you want to set up and prioritize in your business going forward and sort of make a plan on which things you're going to do in what order that will make sense for you and your business. I'm really getting excited about this class because I've been really wanting to help small business owners get those first main systems set up before you go spend money on a system you don't need because Google can do it. The way I think about it, if you're paying for Google Workspace because you need that email address, you should use as many of the features as possible before you start layering on other systems, right? And only use the pieces that you need. So I will be doing a video about that because it is important. New business owners, I didn't know either when I started what I needed for my business to function. And so we're going to have discussions about that and sort of make an outline of flow of what kinds of things you need for your business to function. I'm Amy Novick, a professional organizer, Google certified trainer, and productivity specialist. I empower business owners with Google solutions.